the elements of drawing line line is the most basic element of the drawing and in its most basic definition it's what separates one area of the drawing plane from the other a single line will segment your piece of paper into that area and this area The more lines that are added, the more complex and new medias the separations become. Light from dark, foreground from background, positive space from negative space, line can be uniform and all one word. Or to be more interesting and to convey more information with a single line. A single line can be of varying widths. Types of lines There are four types of lines. Horizontal line Vertical line Perpendicular line Parallel lines They are defined based on their orientation and the angles, if any, formed between them. Let's look at each one of them. Horizontal line A line that runs from left to right in a straight line is called a horizontal line. Vertical line A line that runs from top to bottom in a straight line is a vertical line. Perpendicular When two straight lines intersect each other at right angles, such as 90 degree, then these two lines are said to be perpendicular to each other. Here AB and CD are the two perpendicular lines and they are represented as AB perpendicular CD. Parallel lines when two lines never meet each other, no matter how much you extend them, then these two lines are said to be parallel to each other. Lines AB and CD are parallel lines and are always the same distance apart from each other. Parallel lines are represented by the two large arrows on the lines and are represented as AB parallel CD. Shape Shape occurs when the first line is drawn. The most basic definition of shape is the watch area on the paper. Shape is the information that is presented between two or more lines or is the thing that is enclosed by line. Shape helps define the object that is depicted as much as the collection of lines that make up the object in the drawing. Incorrect use of shape will cause the drawing to not look like what it's supposed to be. Proportion and Perspective Proportion is the size of one picture element in relation 
to the side of another. In other words, proportion is what dictates that, in humans, legs are longer than arms, the middle finger is longer than the pointer finger, and the nose is the same length as the width of the eye. If proportion is incorrect in a drawing, it doesn't look right. Perspective is the illusion that further away things appear smaller. To make something appear to be further away from the viewer than the picture plane, draw it smaller than the object that is closer to the picture plane. proportion and perspective together as one drawing element because they both use each other to work. If one is incorrect, chances are the other is also incorrect. Light and Shadow Light and shadow create depth and atmosphere in a drawing. In order to make a drawing look realistic, you need shadow because in the real world everything has a shadow. Draw something with only one width line and don't render shadow, drawing is going to look flat, two dimensional and unrealistic. Adding shadow automatically adds a small bit of perspective to the drawing because the shadow indicates that something is in front of and or behind the object that would cause it to cast a shadow.